Alléluia, Alléluia, Alléluia.
ushindwa ni kuite hivi leo na kuita nisiki
Nutre que te yo, 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 yo,
Hallelujah. 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 Tugire umwuka w'Imana abari we akomeza kuganza mu buzima bwacu muri aya masengesho muri uno bihe turimo byo gushaka amaso y'Imana. Haleluya. Amazi y'ubugingo atembe mu buzima bwawe. Ubona Imana ubona ubwiza bw'Imana kandi wumva ijwi ry'Imana. Yesu ashimwe cyane. Yo dushaka Imana Imana irigaragaza. Yo dushaka Imana Imana iravuga. Yo dushaka Imana Imana ibana natwe. Reka muri kano kanya ubwire muka wera ngwi uganze imitekereze yanje uze uganze mu ntambara zanje uze uganze mu bibazo byanje uze uganze mu byo ncamo byose uganze reka amazi y'ubugingo atembe muri twebwe atembe mu iteraniro atembe muri twebwe atembe mu buzima bwacu mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo reka dufatanye muri kano kanya za muri jwi rya muri kano kanya mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu data muri kano kanya tuzamuye amajwi yacu mwami twongeye kandi gusenga dusaba mwami imana ikomeye kubaho kumuka w'Imana kugira ngo kubane nato kudushoboze mu izina rya Yesu Kristo kutuganze Tuwebu gachu nago tukwa vishobora. Tuwebu gachu nago tukwa jera yo. Tuwebu gachu nago tukwa soza. Tuwebu gachu witeka mani kome inachu tukwa kuimarira. Hariku hamge nu muka wera aradu shoza. Habana natu kwe akadu chichira. Nyo mamu tu mamaga yiku jamu mami. Habari uzu ganze. Habari uzu ganze. Aze aganze muri tukwe. Aze aganze mu mitima. Aze aganze mu mite cherezo. Aze aganze mu vizima uge acho. Aze aganze mu njendo za acho. Aganze mu vijacho mami. Muru njendo rugu misi mirongwine. Muka wera aganze. Aganze mu vizima uge awe. Na uta shobo ya gushoboze. Na uta fite ushoboze. Moku ya kura gushoboze. Nisi na likome ya Yesu Kristo. Muka wera ambi kimbaraga. Ambi kimbaraga uzima uge acho. Ambi kimbaraga uzima uge acho. Ambi kimbaraga uzima uge acho. Bada natu e muka wera. Dushichire muka wera. Dukomeze muka wera. Nisi na likome ya Yesu. Uganze, 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 uganze. Uganze masenje esho. Uganze masenje esho. Uganze umisi mirongwine. Nisi na likome ya Yesu Kristo. Wabanyi nunga ambi ya Yesu Kristo. Mungu ya nafashi jie joku wa muta. Ajie kusengi misi mirongwine Wabanyi nawe Reka natu kubane natuwe Ururu jendo mngami Gwi misi mirongwine Nye kushaka maso hawe Ushawazu wako mgawe mngami Misi na likome ya Yesu Kristo Kujiza kumushosa mngami Reka maso yubu jingo atembe muritwe Reki maraga zima na zikaraga ya muritwe Reki maro zima na zizuke muritwe Reki kushate mkima na wukweke wuziba wakacho Misi na likome ya Yesu Kristo Kugi maraga zumuka wera mngami Kwenye tuwonu kisa mgawe mngami Kwenye tuwonu kwa rakwa mngami Kwenye tuwonu Mwenye ni mwamu duhembu ure Misi na arja yesu kubugi mbaraga zomuka wera Imitechele za achi hembu uke Nama senjesha ya achi hembu uke Ijilicha no chima na mwritwa jihembu uke Misi na arja yesu kristo Uganze mwri jose muka wera Uganze mwri jose muka wera Uganze, uganze Kandu uganze mwri ya matela ni wa sasita Uigara gaze muka wera Hallelujah Mwujifu tosengira mwusi Tujegu sengira mwusi Tujegu sengira iti indarija bagabo Abagabo bose Mwumuri Mumuri mo wisha mbori yukuri kuisios imana iduha baga ba tini imana kandi ba basenzi ba zahora ba shaka imana kandi ba gasawa nukirwa umanya wabo naba mina ba tamji mungo zabo ba gaha garara muru umanya kandi ba chira nuse hallelujah zamu na majuri atu sengi la baga wao imana ikomeze kuwa hindura umutwe inshingano zabo ba zikoreneza mizi na rikome rija iso kristi imani ba kore shemuri yabo da sanswe kandi ba ba anhu ba jie kuwa kingo zabo zikomere. Ugami bwima na we mungo zabo imbaraga z'Imana bahagare nk'abatambyi n'abami data mu izina rya Yesu Kristo tuzamura mwa mani ikome abagabo kwisi yose mwa witeka imana ikomeye bahagaze muri uyu murimo w'ijambo ry'ukuri bana nabo mwami wanje mana yanje ubarinde ikiba kubita cyose ubarinde icyabavana mu shingano ubarinde icyabatuma mwa mani ikomeye bataba mwami bataba abagabo bakwiriye mungo zabo mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu reka basobanukirwe ishingano zabo reka basobanukirwe witeka aba ribo reka basobanukirwe umwanya bahagazemo reka basobanukirwe mwa mani ikomeye gaciro ka mu muryango mwa mani ikomeye mungo zabo ba data wera mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo ubakomeze mwami bahinduke abinginzi bahinduke abasenzi bingingira ingo zabo mwa mani ikomeye kandi bahora bagushaka amanwa na nijoro Noro kuingiga mwizi na Yesu Kristo uwiteka we basobanukirwe aho uwiteka umwanya wabo mwami bamenye karabami nabatambyi mu miryango yabo mwizi na rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo baza niminduka aho batuye baza niminduka aho bakorera baza niminduka miryango yabo mwizi na rikomeye rya Yesu 
mano bakoreshe mu murimo wa bakoreshe mu gihugu bakoreshe aho bagenda bakoreshe mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo amaboko barambukiye kugyanga barwanye mwami reke yose avunagurike mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu ababuza mwami imana ikomeye gukora ishingano zabo uko bikwiriye Jehova reke iyo migambi y'umwanzi ku buzima bwabo yose burizwemo mu izina rya Yesu Kristo bongere kandi basubira na gaciro agaciro wabahaye mwami imana ikomeye ko kwitwa batware mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo reke abatwara no mwami ingo zabo ubwenge bw'Imana mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu reke abinyuze gusenga mwami uhembure ingo zabagabo uhembure ingo zabo uhembure mwami imana ikomeye mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu haleluya tujye gusengera Tanzania igihugu cya Tanzania ndetse no muryango authentic word ministries muri Tanzania kugira ngo Imana ibakomeze mu kwizera kandi uzuze imitima yabo ya buri mukristo muri bo urukundo rwa BNS bakundane ndetse no muri mo w'Imana bakunda Imana bakunda muri mo w'Imana ndetse bakunda no bwabo reka dusengere igihugu cya Tanzania mu izina rya Yesu ndetse no muri mo w'ijambo ry'ukuri muri cyagihugu datanyira icyubahiro mana nkuru twongeye kuzamura mwa mana ikomeye Tanzania mana ni igihugu datamiza mana ikomeye data wera duturanye turasenga kugira ngo mwami gikomeze kugaragara mu imbaraga zawe mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu turasenga kugira ngo ubyutse bukigaragaremo reka umuyaga w'iminduka uwe muri cyagihugu Mwizi na rikome ya Yesu Kristo mana ibita kunezeza muri kya gihugu muri Tanzania witeka we bikurweho mwizi na rya Yesu ramburi kiganza cyawe ma ukore kuri Tanzania ma ukore ku byobozi bwa Tanzania ma ukore ku batanzania bose ma ukore mwizi na rya Yesu Kristo mana umugambi wa usore mana umugambi wa usore mana ibyo uvuga kuri kya gihugu mwami bibeho mwizi na rikome ya Yesu Kristo ariko ibyo abanzi bavuga ibyo bakora ibyo bubaka byose turabisenya mwizi na rikome ya Yesu reko muri mwa ubakike mwami uwiteka mana ikomeye binyuze mwami muri ministeri ya mwami imu muri mu jambo ry'ukuri mu izina rya Yesu Kristo reko usoze imigambi yawe reko usoze ubushake bwawe mu izina rya Yesu Kristo abakristo aba Kristo bose mwami abahagaze mwa mari ikomeye muri mu jambo ry'ukuri mwa muri cya gihugu reko komeze kubakoresha mu izina rya Yesu Kristo ubuze urukundo bakundane kandi bakomeze kunda muri mwa wawe mwami mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo ubarinde gucika inege ubarinde mwa mari ikomeye kwa namuka ahubwo komeze mwami kirikiringira muri wowe kandi data nyiri ngabo mwami bategereza ubwiza bwawe igihe uzaboneka mwami wanje reka tugushimire tugukomera amashi urakoze jehova mwizi na rikomeye rya Yesu oh haleluya amen buri gihe twa hoja duhora dusengera igihugu cyacu amen haleluya ongera ugisengere ongera ugikunde ongera kandi ukifuriza ibyiza ugihanurire mwizi na rya Yesu data dufatanyije no gwako bwawe Kongye kuzamura igihugu cyacu waduhaye mwami cy'urwanda turakizamura mwa mari ikomeye imbere y'amaso yawe mana igihugu gifite amasezerano nakomeye mwami imana ikomeye ari kumwanzi aragihagurukira akakirwanya ariko ntabwo yagishobora kuko uri kumwe mwami n'abanyarwanda kandi data mwiza ugifite mu buturo niyo mpamvu senze kugira ngo mwami imana ikomeye ukomeze kwigarura imitima y'abanyarwanda bose wigarura imitima yose mwami biki gihugu wigarure mwa mari ikomeye data mwiza mwami intara zose z'iki gihugu mana uziturema mana uzikoreremo Reka igicano cy'Imana cyo kumenya Imana cyo kuramya Imana cyo guhimbaza Imana witeka we gihagarare mwa Imana ikomeye mwa misozi yose y'u Rwanda mwa Imana ikomeye cyake muri iki gihugu mwizi na rya Yesu Kristo niko dusengiye abanyarwanda bose mwa kugira ngo bakumenye kugira ngo bakizwe kugira ngo witeka mwa Imana ikomeye bakubahe kugira ngo bagutambire mwa Imana ko bitambo by'amashimwe kugira ngo bagukorere mwizi na rya Yesu Kristo nabaramya iga ibigirwa mana nabaragusaga nabaterekeraga bose niko tubahamagaye duhagaze kuri uyu musozi mwa reka baveyo reka baze reka banze mu nzu y'Imana reka mwa baruhure reka batabare kuko imbaraga zawo zikomeye mwizi na ikomeye rya Yesu mwa mutanga umugisha mu buryo budasanzwe umugisha wo mu kirere muri iki gihugu umugisha wo mu butaka umugisha wo mu mazi uboneke mwizi na ikomeye rya Yesu Kristo umugisha wo mu misozi umugisha wo mu mashamba mwa muboneke muri iki gihugu mwizi na ikomeye rya Yesu Kristo mwa mugikomeze gukomera mwa mugikomeze gutumbagira mwizi na rya Yesu Kristo twirukanye umuka w'inzara muri iki gihugu twirukanye umuka mwami w'ubutayo muri iki gihugu mwizi na rya Yesu Kristo ibyo rezo byose mwami twivanye muri iki gihugu reka witeka we utubera inyike mu gihugu cy'u Rwanda utubera inyike mu gihugu cy'u Rwanda utubera uburinzi bukomeye mu gihugu cy'u Rwanda mwizi na rikomeye rya Yesu Kristo ndasenze kugira ngo mwami mwa ukomeze gutegeka mwami kandi utegekere mu banyarwanda turabigushimiye byose tugukomera amashyi haleluya amen yesa ba umugisha cyane kandi mwumve mikaze mu nzu y'Imana amen turacyakomeje amasengesho y'iminsi 4 Yumosi no musi wa gatano mu minsi 40 turi imbere y'Imana. 
ushobora ko wenda yamakuru bwa mbere yumvise ushobora kwifatanya natwe ni karibu tujyane amasengesho kandi uzabona uko kwiza kw'Imana ku buzima bwa haleluya nimugoro bara materaniro mwisanzwe hari gicano ninjoro abantu bararamo kuva saa tatu kugeza saa 10 nimwe za mu gitondo niba ture saa 10 nimwe nibisanzwe kugeza saa moya na saa tatu hano kugera gutya muri zigaho ndaturimo yesa shimwe cyane haleluya rero yesa bo mugisha kandi mukomeze kuguga neza mu izina rya Yesu reka duturire imana ibya 10 na maturo hanyuma tuyihimbarishe ibyo yaduhaye kana yo izatugomororera imigisha mu izina rya Yesu reka dushime imana dufite ibiseke hano tuza guturiramo kuba yafite kashi hanyuma nabandi bafite kuri telefone zabo code ni 0372708 0372708 duturire imana reka dushime imana data turagushimira cyane kuga amaturo ni bya 10 tuzanye mu nzu yawe imana reko byakire ubyeze ubihumanure kandi mwami bikore muri mu mwiza mu bwami bwawe turabigushimiye kandi uha uhe mugisha uri wese mwamana ikomeye ugiye guturira mu izina rikomeye rya Yesu amen nikari wazafu Shower ka do haguru ke do himbaze man. Uhara ho ni wawe man, ni wawe jo sevi hanza maso. Uhara ho ni wawe man, ni wawe jo sevi hanza maso. What to wear if Dingiro? 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 Oh, Hora, oh, Ni wawe, ni wawe, ushikikirizi na mgeza achu 
Urasi zikanye Kanini wowe nyine chingiro Wow 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 Yes, Ashim. Yes, Ashim. Amen. Imana ni bjiri njiro bjao. Our God is your hope. Yawa uwe teka ni bjiri njiro bjao. If God is your hope. 
tukaba turi kumwe muri amateraniro ari ku witeka ari we byiringiro byawe when god is our hope and you are here in the sanctuary twamuzamuri ishimwe tukamushima and we praise him and thank him tukamubwira ngo mana uri byiringiro byacu and we tell him you are our hope mana uri imbaraga zacu you are our power Mwami Yesu uri inkomezi zacu. Lord Jesus you are strengthened. Twamubwira ko ari we gakiza kacu. Lord you are our salvation. Twamubwira ko ari we duhanza amaso. You are the only one with with this. Ni we wenyine waduchiza umuvumo. You the only one that can take away any curse. Akaduchiza imbaraga zashibukiye mu miryango. And you can take away any force that has erupted from our families. Akadusenya nibicaniro bya Satan. And you can destroy all the devil uh, uh, altars. Akaturwanira intambara and fight our big battles intambara zo kubutaka the fight on the earth intambara zo mumaraso the blood the, the, the fight in our blood intambara zo mumasano and the fight in our relations intambara zo mungomoko those from where we are from yesu abasha kuzitsinda jesus can defeat them kandi niwe byiringiro byawo and he is your hope kandi nange ni byiringiro byawo and he is my hope as well Come here, man! I'm a shaman, she chan. Give the Lord Jesus a round of applause. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We, we have a sister here. She wants to thank God. She wants to thank God. God bless her. We have a sister here. She wants to thank God. She wants to thank God. God bless her. Satan wanted to steal her. She wanted to. She would have done it tomorrow, but it is not possible for her tomorrow. Hallelujah. 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 Bagazano shimimana. I'm standing here to thank God. Ejimana yangore ibintu bikomeye. God made an amazing thing to me yesterday. Byari ku mugoroba wa saa moya na 1:45 It was around 7:40:45. Nari ndi kuva mu kazi. I was quitting my job. Ubwo ni mu muji in in town. Nerekeza muri zino nzira. I was coming on this way. I was on a motorbike. When we got to Peage, we heard a, a big noise of things that were hitting behind us. When we tried to look behind, it was a bus that lost his brake. The way or the path we were in, that same bus was on that road. We were I, coming down. I was very afraid and I thought of getting off the motor. And I thought of getting out of the motorbike and then go and run. For the way I was seeing the event happening, when the bus could have come and hit us. By the minute I was thinking of it, the motorbike, the motor guy wanted to be quick so that he gives away or get away from the way of the bus. I didn't even realize that the motor as I was thinking of getting rid to it, he, was, he accelerated. And at that time when he had accelerated, I was not well seated. I just clinged on, on him. And because it was the time of leaving the jobs, a lot of cars were on the, on, on the way. There was a big traffic jam, and the red light, the red light had stopped the cars. They were supposed to stop on that same way. And everyone at that time was just thinking of how to escape, how to save their lives, and it was a chaos on the road, and then we fall on, on each other. 
nabaye nkuta reconnaissance yo gato nago mbyibuka neza ukuntu twaguye nabaye nkuta yo bwenge yo gato ya muri yo minota uretse ko nabyutse nkabona ko moto zose zari zagwiranye nabantu bagwiranya ko ngiyewe tugwa ntago mbyibuka neza nuko twaguye nuko byagenze nabonye ko twaguye nyuma I didn't realize that we fell down or at the time all the people get hit one to another I just came to realize that I was down I don't know what really happened but what I remember very well when I brought uh, my conscience came back and the coaster came I was lying down on the road. They did not pass over me. They carried on, and by he, he passed by me. He wanted to be on the side of the wall on peage. My bag and uh, and the, the the package I had on me. The car, the car passed through it, crushed it. Shoko shirachika agapande kugapande. And then the bag was crushed totally. Ichindi jitanga za nawa nyimana yangure emoji komeye. Another miracle I saw God doing for me. Kwa kundina shate kufakuri moto. By the time I wanted to get to get off the motorbike. Yombi shobora nga yivako. Had I met it. Narigupa. I would have died. Kuko saidi na shaka ga kujaho. Because the side I wanted to run to. The side I wanted to run for is the same side the driver used when he wanted to break or, or maybe to diminish all the risks and not kill a lot of people. He just went on the side I wanted to run. If I had I done that, I would have died. Hallelujah. I thank God for he increased the day of my lives. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. I have one prayer request. Hallelujah. I want that you pray for me to do what God wants me to do because there is a purpose on my rescue. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. There's a time when you pray unto the Lord when you're here, but you only see your God when you're on the road. There are times you pray unto the Lord when you're here, and you see him in your house, and you see him in your children, and you see him in your servants, and you see him in your work. One thing I captured from this, the road, the way she was in, the part of the road she was in is the same side the coaster was in. Can be Let me just try to do the, the, the part she was in is the, the same Satan was in. Hmm. Kujirango bitaza tambuka ina persi imana itanga image yuko ya gomba kuvadi ishira kuisakosh. True, for it to not be despised, instead of you to die and to be crushed the same as the bag was, he made it to see the bag. Kujirango no jure bisakoshi umenye kari kwa rukumiz. So that when you look at the handbag, you just say, "This was me to be there." Hallelujah. The protection of the living God over your life. The protection of the Lord over your life. Let me tell you. 
This is a sample that the Lord brought to us in this lunch hour. A sample from the fields. For we are like people who are in their classrooms. And we need uh, didactics materials. Then the Lord is saying that let me just show you how I protect there is nothing else he will protect you for it is for you to serve him Joshua said from now on choose who you are going to serve if the idols your forefathers used to worship tell it so that when you are on the road you know which one you are going to call upon your rescue the Lord wants us to choose to who is going to protect and who is going to release in the hand of whom he chooses. We are in the time of choosing people of God. We are in the time to choose do not take care of other people. We have people who are living in their choices. And whatever they chose, it is there and it's very clear. Your things as well has to be clear. Your choice has to be clear. And then whoever looks at you, know the God you have chosen. In your wearing, the Lord is there. In your speeches, they will know who you are. In your hope, they will know who you chose. For people who did not choose are really confusing us. And these are very confusing God, even on the road of Kigali. Hmm. Nobody, you got to buy in our sense. This God, He rescued you. I did not pray. You may be having something in which God has a souvenir. We thank God who is keeping and protecting us. The same way He protected you yesterday, the same way He protects us. Hallelujah. The things that are coming on the side, flee from you. the side, this is going away from you. Let everything that has come may the Lord seek for the Lord and sacrifice and go away from your life and go away from your body. For you are the temple of the Holy Spirit. Go and serve God in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Wow. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I didn't know why Joshua is insisting to tell us to choose. How, uh, how if he, he let them just keep on confusing it? Let them just keep on confusing it. But he beseeched with them to choose. We are in the season of choices. And we choose for our families. And the families that took decision for others have the repercussion on others. There are people who are just leaving the backfire of their forefathers, grandfathers and great-grandfathers. Others are leaving the, the disadvantage of worshipping idols. Others are leaving the consequences of the day they quitted the gate in which Satan entered. But the Lord is telling us that the time to choose has come. This is the time and the season you have to choose the God you have to serve. Yes, Hashim. Praise the Lord. Why are you despaired? You haven't yet chosen. Can we give you five minutes to choose who you're going to serve? The way I see you are despaired. Are there something that are confusing? Yes, Hashim. 
Yes, Ashim. Yes, Ashim. Praise the Lord. Yes, Ashim. Praise the Lord. Yes, Ashim. To the Mitter and are we in a situation where we are not oppressed? Is there someone who has no, been rescued? Now how are you starting to be mourning when the Lord has given joy? How are you going to gather with the, the, the crumbled God? How are you going to gather with the crumbled God? Gather with the people the Lord has saved. Do not think about the bag that has been scratched. You are... <laughs> There is someone who is thinking about the things that were in the bag. <laughs> These are the do you see the things we are running for? Sometimes it loses its value in a, in a minute. Imagine if it was the salary that she had worked for. Will it she be regretting about the salary? In the, bag? the valuable things is the life. In another word, even no, for you, no, no, you are not in a morning time. Because there are things that you lost. The things you remain with. It is time for you to get it. To get a value. For this is the, the things God is going to start from. Bringing and restored what you lost. There are things that you are remaining with after Chichinu your battles. Sna uh, keep it. If it is God, keep him. If it is faith, keep it. If it is your altar, keep it. But I know what I, remain, I am remaining with is the great value. Now I know that the things that has been uh, heated by the costa is what God gave away. For the people who came late, the person who was thanking God has gone, but you can ask the people near you, they took notes. We're going to read in Genesis 28, verse 10. Yakobo ava in Jacob went out of Beersheba and went toward Haran. And he lighted, uh, he, he lighted upon a certain place and tarried there all night because the sun was set. And he took off the stones of that place and put them for his pillows and lay down in that place. Ararota, and he dreamed, and behold, the ladder set up on the earth, and the top of it reached to heaven. And behold, the angels of God ascending and descending on it. And the angels of God Lord stood the, uh, and behold the Lord stood above it and said I am the Lord God of Abraham thy father and the God of Isaac the land here on thou liest to thee will I give it and to thy seed yeah. <laughs> Ruzahana no mukungu go hasi, Uzakwira, Iwenji Razuva ni Rasi Razuva ni Kaskasi ni Kusi, Kandi Muriwa we ni mo Rubja Rugwa we ni mo imidjango yose, yom nisi izahirwa umodisha. Durendi kumge nawe, nzaku rinda, aho uzaja hose, kandi, nzaku garura, murichi jihugu, kuko, naza gusiga, narakora, ivjo, ngovgiye, yakobo, arakanguka, aravogati no kuri, uiteka, arahaha, narimurizi karitsi. Mm. Nanya narin havis. 
waratinya aravuga ati erega ahantu hateye ubwoba ahantu nta kindi ni inzu y'Imana aha ni irembo ry'ijuru haleluya tujye no muri nanone mwitangira 12 ababwire kugyango baze kwasoma it is in genesis 12 ku murongo wa 7 uwiteka abonekera buramu oya kamera yejo mere kuri kane from 4 aburamu aragenda nkuko uwiteka yamutegetse roti ajyana nawe ubwo yavaga iharane aburamu yaramaze imyaka 75 avutse aburamu ajyana sarayi umugore we na roti muhungu wabo nubutunzi bwose bari batunze nabantu baronkeye iharane bavanwayo no kujya mu gihugu cy'Kanani Kanani ubwayo niho basohoye gatandatu Aburahamu anyura muri cyo gihugu agera hitwa Ishekemu hari igiti kitwa umweroni cyamore muri cyo gihe umunyakanani yari muri cyo gihugu karindwe uwiteka abonekera Aburahamu aramubwira ati urubyara rwawe nza nzaruha iki gihugu yubakira y'igicaniro uwiteka wamubonekeye umunane avayo ajya ku musozi w'iruhande rw'iburasirazuba rw'ibeteri abamba ihema rye beteri iri ruhande rw'iburasirazuba na ai iri ruhande rw'iburasirazuba yubakira y'uwiteka igicaniro yambaza izina rya uwiteka buramu akomeza kugenda yerekeye inegebo amen Yesu nashim. Praise the Lord Jesus. We are in our prayers of 40 days. We are building our altars in our families and in the our altar of God is mighty. And we build it with our prayers. There are things we build in prayers. And there are things that we destroy in prayers. And anything that is built in prayers. No one can destroy them on a mountain. And I think that we destroyed in the prayer. No one can rebuild it on, on the mountain. The, the prayer are powerful. Prayers are powerful. Your prayers are very important. You being in the presence of God is of utility. And the prayers you pray have a benefit for you. Let me tell you that our prayers are not sustaining the living God. When we did not pray, our God is not lying when he did not pray. But you, if you stop your prayer, sometimes you not even be able to eat. But you, uh, but him, if you do not pray unto him, he will never lie sleepless. But if you stop it, your husband may quit you. Even your life is going to be a life of struggle. When you pray, it is bringing a profit to us. Even if the profit of our prayers are also the profit of the kingdom of the Lord. But we are the first person that have the benefits of our prayers. The altar is being built by the prayers. And the heart altar is built by prayers. And no more life is a life which has the altar in it. A life that has an altar has the dwelling place in it. When you have oh, you arranged an, an altar of the living God in you, it is easy to the Lord to come into you. Yes, you Praise the Lord Jesus. Now, God, we have seen in the church, in the church, in the church, in the as we said before, the Lord has a throne in heaven, He has on earth, He has in, in, in nations, in territory, and in individuals. Therefore, it is very good that we implant 
the altars of the Lord every, at every place I mentioned. But we are talking in a special way on family altars. The Bible told us the history of Abraham. He passed through the ways of Haran. And he went to Shechem. He carried on. He went to Negev. In these ways. Are the ways that even Jacob used. He passed through those uh, that way and and then he carried stones and he made them pillows. And then he lied down there. And the Bible tells us that he has a great and the Lord showed him great and mighty things. And he saw a ladder mounting to heaven. Yet angels were climbing and up ascending. It. On the top of that ladder were the throne of the living God. And then the Lord told, told him in this, in this country of Canaan that you I are. I will give it to your generation. This land you stepped into. And the Lord told him you are not the first one to step into this land. I am the Lord of your father Abraham. And I am the Lord of your your father Isaac, you, I am Abraham. the Lord of your grandfather Abraham, and your father Isaac. Your grandfather used to pass through this neighborhood, and he put and established an altar. But the word I'm telling you, I told him before. I told him that I'm going to give him this country, and I will give it to his generations. I repeat this. This land, I am giving it to you. As well. And your offspring, I am strengthening my covenant that I told you, Father, and your father. In other words, in a spiritual way, he was handing over, he the, he was handing over the promises from the forefathers to, to another generation. This is how it operates. In the realm of the spirit, there is a handover of promises and the promises of heritage. This is how it happens in the heaven. The people who have altars, which are not gods, there are people who find themselves in doing a work of witchcraft and witchcraft. Not being their choice, but it is a heritage from their families. And there is no way to get out. Yes, but this week, the Lord wants to put a gate for you. He takes you out from a good heritage and gives you a good heritage. Everything that has been inherited from your fathers is not honoring God. Is not honoring God. Then you will destroy it during this prayer. If it is a bad, then you will destroy it in this prayer. We are praying for our families, but we found that we are not honoring God. We are fighting against powers that are older than us, but that's not are not greater than our God. The things that are greater that, that are ever than are not greater than us. It might, be, it might have been taken for very long, but it's not greater than your God. Jambo. <laughs> Jambo. 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 In the beginning was the word. The word was God. And he was with God. Anything that fights against you, anything that is following you, has become a narrative to your life. It, it has a continuity in your life. In this service, God is saying, Stop. Stop you cast. 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 I want you to do something. Stop. 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 If you are 
is poverty. Stop. Stop. It is dead. 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 It is It is dead. 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 And sicknesses, uh, if it is sicknesses, it is the life of sin. There are things that you have to tell, stop. Your life, your situation, will stop you. Your curse will stop you. Your poverty, your despise, your division, your hatred, your drunkenness, your fornication. Stop. We say stop. May the Lord stop it. This is why you are here today. You want God to stop everything that has been difficult to be stopped by you. May the Lord stop the things that was complicated to you. The things that has become like an habit. With your family it is an heritage. May the Lord attack it right now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yakobo, he found in the house that his grandfather has built an altar before. Sometimes you find yourself in a place where your people passed before. There are times you find in a, in a, in a place. The word the Lord speak to Abraham in the same word that is coming back to Jacob. Sometimes, sometimes there are things you find in your house, but when you discuss with your parent, you find that it is not the first time it is coming. And then they will tell you, our daughter, our son, we were expecting this. I knew you will never have a marriage. I always knew that you will divorce. How do they know that? He knows, he knows, she knows the heritage of your family. Yes, Hashim. Praise Jesus. Yes, Hashim. Praise Jesus. Yes, Hashim. Praise Jesus. They are people who are not the heritage of God is taking them off the heritage of the family. And he is ushering them into a covenant that is a new world. The Lord told Jacob that this one, I am giving it to you. As I gave it to your forefathers. And then he rose. And he said, oh. Yeah. Oh, there is God in this place. I didn't know that. Where, how did he mention God? How did he know about God? He is in a land, in a place. His grandfather has built an altar for the Lord. Because an altar never grow old. An altar never grow old. An altar that you build today will never grow old. As the, the altar of your family is not growing. As the word of your forefathers, grandfathers, but they never grow old. That's why where people mention something, the Lord is placing his own word. Where people said something, the Lord is placing his own word. There are people who are ruled or who are guided by the word of their father. Hmm. Hand over. Hand over. Hand over. Hand over. 
be off of the hands of people. Be off the hands of people. And be placed in the hands of God. Be off of the hands of the Christ. And be in the hands of Christ. Be off of the, uh, the blood of Adam. And, 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 and go in the hand of the May the Lord shift you. May the Lord shift you. May the Lord transfer you. May the power of the Lord. May he transfer you from that altar. May he transfer your blood. In the name of Jesus. Whatever you are pursuing from the blood line, let them do not see you anymore from your blood. Man, they don't take any things of yours from the blood line of your family. Let them take all your CV from the blood line of your family. And be in the blood of Jesus. Every disease that's taking you from the blood of your father, let them not see you anymore. But when they see you, let them see in the blood of the living Jesus. They are where sickness are deprived of their power. Where they become observers. It is only in the name of Jesus. Amen. Yakobo asanze anu sekuru yanyuse ashirigichaniro. Jacob found himself in a place whereby his grandfather passed and puts an altar. He had a good foundation. He had a good foundation. A foundation known by God. The things you are in. It is an heritage for your children. It is an heritage for your grandchildren. They will speak about the things that you have in life. God will repeat it to them. The things that the Lord told you in this country. Your great grandchildren. Will find themselves in this run. Even though I'm seeing some people traveling and going abroad. Your children will come back. When they come here, they will encounter prophecy. And they will tell them the God of your father and the God of your mother that prayed in Zion is saying this. I will protect you. I will be with you. Even though you travel and went abroad, the prayers of your mother, the prayers that sent you, when we pray the Lord, what we pray is more than having frank money in the banks. Hallelujah. The money that you put in a bank, they charge it. But the prayer you prayed, the Lord is giving you profit. When he had a dream, the dreams do not come easily. And it's not found on any ground. When you go at your grandfather's house, tell me the dreams you have. And then I will tell you the altar you worship on. When he got on the altar of the, Lord, the real God, he had a visitation from the Lord. And altar is powerful. Jehuza, ijuru, nubuzima, ijuru, numuryango, ijuru, nijihugu, ijuru, nakarere. And altar connects. It connects a nation with heaven. It connects a family with a nation. It connects an individual with connection with, with heaven. He would see angels. Mounting and descending. Mounting and descending. They come to Jacob and say what you have to say. And they will go to heaven and tell the issue. And then God will bring answers. And they will say others. They will mount up. And they will say there is disease. And then he will bring cures. And they will say others. There is something that we did not hear very well. They will come up. And the Lord will give you explanation. And then they will go down. And then he saw all the sin. And he put it in the mind of Jacob. The power of an altar. 
People who live in an old town. They know the secret of their families. They know who have problems in their families. And they know the source of their problems. And they know the source of their issues. They, they know and know and know. For the ladder Ruracahari. is still operating. Ruracahari. The ladder on, on which angels are ascending and climbing, it is not there. It has no grease. It is standing well. It is standing well. It is standing well. For it is not a, 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 tool, for, it is a, a tool from heaven on earth. Are the tools that the Lord is going to bring down to your house. The Lord is going to put a banner of in your house. There is a banner of victory. There are banners that the Lord is mounting into your house. Not of, uh, not of LGBTQ. I'm talking about the one. I'm speaking of the victory one. Not of, of LGBTQ. Not of dying prematurely. Not of Divorcing, not of being widowed, it is the one of victory. God is bringing down something for you. The Lord is bringing a ladder for you. And He has been, He is bringing tools. I saw heaven supplying tools in your house. I am seeing tools of communication. We are going to start to dream about the things of heaven. We are going to dream about heaven. Your dreams that has appeared. The Lord is bringing them to you. Every tool of communication is being restored. Where God speaks to you normally. Where God speaks to you normally. Your vision. God is bringing them back. Lord is bringing them back. You are going to hear the voice. The Lord is bringing it back. Your dreams you used to have, the Lord is bringing them back. Because you are now restoring your altar. I speak about the power of an altar. I speak about an altar that does not grow. An altar of God. The day David counted or censored and God was putting him about it. And he gave him three flags that he has to choose about it. He sent the prophet God to be defeated by his enemy. The, the sword of the living God and the pandemic and he said I will dwell or I will die in the hands of the living God and it will pass three days after he chose the Lord is waiting for your choice the Lord needs to you to choose and then the Lord oh my God he sent the angel to, to kill everyone he exterminated, he exterminated them but when he went on the crown of Ornan, hallelujah, the Lord restrains the And he said, enough. And then God ran. And he told David, the Lord said, run quickly and go and build an altar for the living God. And then he ran to Ornan and came to the ground of Ornan. And he said, my Lord has told me this one. That man said, no, 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 I cannot. Yeah, cheer, yeah, cheer. Just take it, take it. David, then he say, no. He say, I cannot do anything. I have to pay my cash. After he gave a price. And then he built an altar for the living God. And at this moment. The Lord stopped the pandemic. The altar that you have. Is going to stop this incident. Is going to stop this incident. The Lord is going to heal. 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 The Lord is going to be an hospital that is called the altar in your house. Not, not that is going, people are going to have the hill to hear. They are going to stop diseases. A power that stops diseases. The world cures sicknesses. And the church will stop. 
Hallelujah. There is power of Jesus that is seated in you, that is seated in me, that will not allow people to look, that stops. I am stopping the disease. I am stopping the disease in your family. I am stopping cancer. I am stopping diabetes. In the name of Jesus. I am starting migraine. The victory banner. The victory banner. The victory banner. Hallelujah. Keep on fanning your furnace your, your, and then the pandemic went away. And they say we cannot fight against this altar. And the angels went back. They say wherever an altar is we cannot kill. Wherever an altar is on that on and ground on the ground of on that's where Solomon built the temple of God. On that ground, ground. on that ground, that's where Solomon said, I myself, there is the power of the altar. Whatever is first, I have to bring in my country. An altar, it pulls infrastructures. An altar. It uses electricity in the neighborhood. At, at an altar. It brings tarmac on every road. An altar of God. An altar of God. In your family. It brings marriages. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm speaking about the power of an altar. Jacob was amazed. I haven't yet watched this kind of movie. I used to use Spider-Man. And I will see Commando. And this happens too. Ah. Now I know. Oh. Now I know. In heaven they have curtains. They? they have seats. Wow. Wow. The people who travel, when they come back, and then you pay visit to them, you see some things that are very beautiful and strange in their house Dubai. because they copied from Dubai. But Jacob, he peeped in heaven and he said, I will put this in my home. The people who peep the things of heaven, when they are doing their things, it has an excellence that is not worthy. It has a spiritual touch. For they peeped in heaven. I want you to peep in heaven. Can you in the heart of the living God? Can you in the mind of the Lord? Can you in the mind of the Lord? Architecture. Architecture. Okay. <laughs> May the Lord give you to peep in the office of architects. May the Lord give you to peep. And he peeped in the heaven. And then he said, oh, you are so wealthy. There are roads, the tamakas are in gold. When God, may God give you money. When God gives you money, just do it as someone who saw how heaven looks like. When God blesses you, do not be stingy. Just do be like someone who peeped in heaven. Call your people and tell them how is it? Do you have a home? How are you living? I uh, I recently had an history of a, a, a young man. It is not the owner of the story. The person who told me the story. Was that, that young person was blessed, and he's wealthy. The first thing he did, he called his brothers and he built houses for them before he did his own. When there was a Cured and safe enough. Hallelujah. When he zipped every <laughs> channel of heaven. <laughs> when he blocked every channel of heaven. And then he 
said, this is me. I'm going to have my own. And he, and he, he went and built the house in Rusorur. <laughs> hey. He faced anything of jealousy. Yeah, way. Let them attack you because you, you deny them things. When you peep in the heart of the living God, you will find there is no greediness there. When God remembers you, you are going to forget about yourself a little bit and then start from others. Let them be at ease. Let them be comfortable. Let them be okay, settled. Sometimes I will find some young people, uh, young children playing. Some of them will just ask one another who will choose to eat first the meat on the plate or to eat late the meat on the plate. The one who eats it before say that I don't want to eat for first and not eat my meat. Another one will say, I will eat to hear and to feel the sweetness of the meat. Another one will tell him, no. You may keep it and a visitor enter. And who is really glutton like and you? And you will never take the sweet potato instead of taking it. I don't really support your thesis. No. Start from others. Start from others. Do you know that? You may ask yourself if I do it and I die before I do mine. When you do it for others. With a good heart. In heaven a pillar is erased. That's why our works are the only ones that will accompany us when someone dies. Money is behind but your works but you use with your work in heaven it is not a that's why your money when you want it it is going to end with the world but if you want it is going to carry on to heaven Amen. It depends on what you decide to do with your money. May the Lord give you money. If you understand this, for you to build here and there, remember others. Why do I say this? It is because there is a vision that is coming to your life. There are things that Lord, the Lord is going to tell you for you have, this, you have decided to put an altar. I am speaking about the power of an altar. The power of an altar. power of an altar. Of an altar. Of an altar. When, put altars in your house. Call your children to pray with you. Tell your husband, even if you don't comprehend this, I want you to be part Queen of it. Come, let us pray. Queen let us pray. Let us pray. There, there is no problem that can be given. Be, be on your altar. Let us tell the Lord what we have done. Let us speak about the miracles of God. Our problem is speak about God at, in other places, but you don't speak about God in our homes. You speak about God when you are on rivers and mountains, but when you get home, you are tired. Speak God in your house. As you keep on talking about the Lord, the words of the Lord will engrave on the, the walls of your altar. And the Lord will read them every time he wants. And he says, What did she tell me this morning? She said that I am powerful. Oui, oui. True. She understood that I'm yes, powerful. Am Jesus told Peter, I know this is not blood and flesh that has revealed this to you. It is my Lord that has revealed this to you. What God is, he, is he saying about your life? It is written on your altar that is in your house. Stop crying and murmuring in your house. For it, because it is more than your prayers in your house. This is the word the Lord is saying. Speak the Lord in your house. Speak the Lord in your gates. Speak the Lord in the corners of your house. Speak the Lord on your beds. Speak the Lord in the, in the bedroom of your children. Speak it in the living room. Speak it in the kitchen. Speak it in the store. Speak it in the wash. 
sure. Speak it in the garden. Every corner of your house, let it, it here. Here. let it be a remembrance before the throne. Of the of God. Those people who know how to decorate, decorate the word of God who are ready to make hits. Speak on the word, speak and build on the word. As others has built their houses on, on uh, heads of courts. Hallelujah. The altar. In your heart, in your house, in your family. When you have put utensils here and there, call one person. Have them seated with you in that same place whereby you've been talking about the God. Why? Why, when you are going to their places, they have placed some hamlets in the in the sittings, in the chairs? This was Satan has no strategy. All the strategies he picks, he stores them from us. We have to have scriptures everywhere, every corner, everything has to have a scripture. A person called me yesterday and said, I want to put an altar in this office. office. The reason why I chose to have an office here, he told me about the good things of having an office at that place after that. And then I told him, you told me the good of it, but let me tell you the bad of it. In the spiritual realm, there is a roundabout in this place. The way you can discover or relate to the things that are very good in the spiritual realm, it is the same applied. And then I say, can we just take a small part from what the devil had? And then we put and we placed our traps. We put, we put, and we put things in corners. Then we prayed. After that, when I got out, what? My car did not want me to go. I was stuck. And I say, we touched one altar. By the time you have tricked something, there are signs you may know and see, but just laugh at it. Hmm. And my partner came and it was the same. The car could not go. But it was sorted a few meters. When he was on his way, a, mot a motorbike came and crushed him. Do you know what Satan wants? Can you go empty handed? Not even pinching you. You are just destroying my thinking. Like Are you going? You are going? Really? And then he sent them all guys. These are little things. Them. For the things that were big, you cut their arms. I was just talking about the power of an altar. No one can fight an altar with words. You cannot enter a wizard heart kicking that you are just hitting the altar. No. A system will always fight a system. And an altar will fight an altar. Stand up as we pray. I want to pray for someone who has a problem with their eyes. It is a problem of eyes that is not from the ones from and it leads to being blind. So someone and the Lord told me. Maso, hataraya wali kuyomu midjango, akomeza. Having problem of eyes and it is a, a no, thing ne. of family. I used to see accident. I didn't know that you don't you don't see. Ii service polisi gomba kuyishurira. Ii ni service yajere ya mahoro. Hoyada. 
This is something, it's a crucial, it's an issue actually. I think the traffic police has to give us something. This morning I was praying for people having problems of eyes. And I thought they were just bringing them to my house. Now I see it. Hallelujah. 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 Ifuka urachari we urachari amana ifuka bikaba urachari amana tege kaiga komera haleluya God told Nathaniel, before you came, I saw you sitting in the church. You came, you came not wanting it, but the Lord saw you under a three. For the people who are wearing glasses, let us just do a sign, a prophetical sign. Let us take our, our glasses and uplift them. The people who have glasses, just uplift them. Take them off and then uplift them. Mana. Lord, this is the tools of this world that helps people to see clearly and it helps them, it assists them. Had this sickness had it been normal we would tolerate it but because it has a source that is deep we refuse it 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 in the name of Jesus 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 in the name of Jesus. We deny it. We reject 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 it. For the people wearing glasses and those who are not wearing glasses that have issues with their eyes. They have migraines. They don't see. Eyes. We deny it. We reject it. Any sickness of the disease of eyes. We reject it in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We are taking them to a mouse. We want them to cleanse their eyes. No more. We want them to be sick clearly. We are taking them to Siloam. We take them to Siloam. We take them to Siloam. We take them to Siloam. We are taking them to Siloam. We are taking them to the pool of Siloam. The power that heals them. Let them come into them. Take your eyes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We curse this sickness. Curse Jesus. Curse the, the fig tree. We curse it, my yopi. We curse the fig tree. That is from the curse of the generation. Uh, the eyes that has been exchanged. We reject it. They reject it. They are eyes that you created them in their purity. Let them be restored. Let them be restored. Let them be restored. Let them be restored. Them be restored. Them be restored. Them be restored. Satan who has still there. They are lands. Bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. 
Let the Lord heal oh, all blindness. Let the Lord heal blindness in the name of Jesus. 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 The power that the power of God. 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 Next to you. As I, I, I touch one person, I will only touch one person. And the person who is behind you, let you make sure you touch someone before. You. Touch everyone that has this issue to the point that if one of you has this problem, if if he is he is bad installation of wires, you. it will supply it is from Pastor Eric and is going to be transferred everywhere. And then the Lord will connect us to the wire that has his power. We are going to mention seven hallelujah. 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 Receive. In the name of Jesus, I receive. May the Lord bless you. If if we have in our midst someone sometimes who becomes blind and don't see anything. To the point you lose your sight. 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 You have to come back if you are that person. Others, you can go with the Lord Jesus. The power of the living God touch you. The power of the Lord touch you. The power of the Lord touch you. Would it a quest career?